Guys, and welcome. My name is Aaron Cooper. Welcome back to another brand new video here today upon my channel, guys. Today, my friends, we're jumping back into Left 4 Resident Evil 1. And this is part 4 to my little mini walkthrough so far. And I'll see there's a leave link down below in the description to my previous Left 4 Resident Evil 1 videos in case you missed any of them. They will be all linked down below. And I just thought to myself, do you know what? I haven't done a video on this in quite a while now. And since Halloween is only around the corner now, guys, it's only a couple of weeks away, I thought, do you know what? Let's get ourselves in the Halloween sort of spirit and unleash the undead and start killing some zombies and start murking them up. So this is why I thought to myself, you know what, let's jump onto Left 4 Dead 2 on the PC and get this modded adventure on its way so then we can try to do some more on this. But I see says I really enjoy part 1, I really enjoy part 2, loved part 3. And I just want to see what part 4 has in store for us. Obviously as well, all the mods and stuff are incorporated into this walkthrough. I know what the mods are. Um, obviously, at the moment, we've got this cool camo for my AK-47. We've got, like, Pokemon, like, um, medikits, which make the Pokemon center sort of theme song every single time. If you remember back in the Game Boy Advance days, when you had to heal a Pokemon at the Pokemon center, they make that ding, 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 ding sort of noise. Well, that's the sound effect that you... One sec, guys. That's a sound effect that you get uh, when you obviously use your medikit. As you've seen in the gameplay so far, as it is, we've got Wreck It Ralph in there, uh, who replaces the charges. We've got Diddy Kong in there that replaces the jockeys. And we've got the four characters from Triarch Zombies. Obviously, got Dempsey, um, Nikolai, Richtofen, and obviously Takio. I'm playing as the character Nikolai for this one. Originally, on my previous videos, I think I was playing as obviously as Dempsey. Uh, but I thought, you know, I'm going to switch it up and be a different character. Uh, I've got SpongeBob in there, Squidward's in there. Um, I did, obviously, if you remember, right, if you remember my previous videos, which I've done on the walkthrough, there was originally um, cat zombies, but I thought to myself, they were, I don't know, they were kind of a pain in the butt to kill, so I thought I switched the cats out and put original zombies in there. And at the moment, just being absolutely plungered by that, by that freaking. Right, charger there, but Asita's, it's okay guys, it's alright. We're still alive, my team members are hopefully going to work with me for this one. We've got Wario in this as well, um, Sandy, and loads of the crazy cool stuff, trust me, so it's, it's going to be awesome. But I'm hoping to do more of these in the nearby future, I want to do like loads of cool little adventures and stuff, and just mess around with mods, incorporate some weird stuff. Like, I want to be one of them sort of people, when I do, like, Left 4 Dead, like, mod gameplays, I want to, like, you know, do the things that you wouldn't think are possible. For example, I want to put Donald Trump in there. I want to blow up Super Mario. I want to, I don't know, fire SpongeBob into the outside of space or something using a rocket launcher. I want to be able to do them sort of weird things, but check out that massive spider on the wall over there, guys. <laughs> that is one big... Freaking spider, look at that. But the thing is though, guys, I don't want to shoot that spider because that spider is actually a mod, okay? And there's a reason why I don't want to shoot that because it will drop loads of tanks. I believe it will be tanks or chargers. And trust me, they will be a pain in the butt to kill. So I'm going to leave that spider alone for now. I may come back to it later on to try and kill it. But not at the moment because... I'm not prepared to kill like 11 or 12 charges when they're coming at me trying to murk me up. Trust me. I'm not down for that right now. Right. So I believe what we need to do now is we need to mess with this little doohickey. Let's spin this again. So what this will do now, obviously, is stop the war. So I'm going to go find out what happens now that the war has stopped. All right, come on, team. All right. <sighs> got a bit of a sore throat today as well, guys. Like, I literally got this like really croggy sort of like thing in my throat. It's horrible. All right. <laughs> Just one big spider. It's like wow. All right. So lift, lift up this grid. And make his way down here. All right, let's do this together. Oh, I'm dropping the frames. Dropping the frames. Don't know what happened then, guys. 
kind of lagged on my screen. I do apologize if it did lag on the screen that you guys are seeing. Alright, I could save it if I had an ink ribbon, but unfortunately at this moment of time I do not. I just wish my game wasn't lagging. I do apologize about this lagging, guys. If you can see it, I do apologize. If you can't, then you're probably thinking, I don't know what the hell are you on about, but on my screen then it was lagging a little bit. It's dropping in frames. Zombies. Reloading. Just leave me alone. It's a great day to kill the undead. Reloading. Speaking of the undead and stuff, guys, and obviously when we mention it, obviously Halloween's only just around the corner and stuff. Yeah, yeah. Says, cause obviously we're practically coming into obviously October now. And Oh, I see it is. I always want to know what you guys have got planned for Halloween this year. Like, are you doing anything good? Are you going to any parties? Or, or are you going out trick-or-treating if you're younger um, people watching this video? Let me know. I'd like to know what you guys are going to be up to this year. Me, personally, I'm probably going to make you guys a butt-ton of videos so you can watch. I might play some scary games or something. I'm not quite sure yet. Um, just thinking about what scary game and stuff I would like to play on my channel as well when it comes to Halloween. Because obviously it's like starting something else, but I don't know, yeah. I might make some mod videos and stuff on Left 4 Dead, or I might play a full walkthrough on something. I'm not quite sure, but don't don't worry about it. You're guaranteed to have videos for me. And then, whilst you guys are watching my videos, I don't know. I might go, go to a Halloween party or something. I'm not, I'm not quite sure yet. I haven't really decided, because obviously, in case you guys are unaware of what's going on with me at the moment, so it is obviously, even though I'm making videos and working a lot, I'm going to be moving soon and stuff, and I've got a lot going on at the moment, guys. So, sisters, I've just got to make sure that, you know, I'm making the most of the time as I can. Getting you guys loads of videos as possible. Because, obviously, when I do move, there may be a little point where I don't upload for a little bit. But, don't want you thinking of disappear or anything. I will be still keeping in touch with you all on social media. And then, obviously, once internet and everything's all set up in the new place, then, you know, I'll be back on my regular grind for videos. Don't you worry. But just make sure you bear that in mind. If there's a point where you don't see no videos for, off me for a little bit, you know what's going on, okay? Let's get rid of all these zombies. Reloading. I've got a big bulldozer over there as well. Just need to be careful. Hi. Uh-oh. No, 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 no. Just move out of the way. Guys, you're going to die. Oh, my days. <laughs> All my team members are dead. I'm sorry, Richtofen. I'm sorry, Dempsey. I'm sorry, Takio. You've gone to a better place now. Only I, Nikolai, shall hold your summoning key and drink vodka whilst I make off a thousand zombies with a pistol. Which doesn't seem to be going down very well at the moment. At the moment... These guys are giving me no chill. Just leave me alone. Well, let me just grab this gun. Let me grab a weapon. Right, there we go. We've got a sniper. We've got a sniper. My health's going down. Just leave me alone. Give me a little bit of breathing space. Move. Oh my days. The sniper rifle's got incendiary rounds. Uh, leave me alone. No scope! I'm just gonna no scope him in the face. Just leave me alone. I might put Marge with a sniper rifle. I don't need to aim. I'll just no scope you all. Right, let's move. Right, is that all of them now? No, it's not. Come on, zombie. Let's try quick, um, quick scope. Quick scope. No scoop. Is zombie gonna die or what? No, screw it. So at the moment it's just me alive, so what's gonna ha probably gonna happen if I remember correctly when it comes to Left 4 Dead is that with your team members, they can come back alive. I just need to go and find them. Because they'll be like held captive, like captured somewhere. Like they could be in a room. I've just got to open the door or something for them. Um, so 
Oh, as you can see there, I've got to go get one of my team members. He needs rescuing. Somehow. How the hell do we get through that? We cut the spider webs. How? Hang on. I will in just a second. I just need to. Oh, okay. Can't go behind there. How do you get past the spider webs? Hang on. I think I think he's around where that big hole was on the floor. Yeah, I'm a cannon. Yeah, you're over here. I'm here. Okay, I'm gonna come let you out. You're welcome, Richtofen. You're holding a cat. How do you feel? Your only weapon that you have is a cat. And you are hidden some- you're literally stuck, held captive on a toilet. That just makes no sense. Um. Really? Have you spawned around there as well? Please don't tell me that. Oh. Where did he go? Have you been... I swear that the characters are spawning around here then. I can hear a jockey. I can't. If he can hear jockeys, then he's got better ears than me, because I, I can't hear no jockeys. Can hear zombies. Bro, I can't hear jockeys. Yeah, let me know what your thoughts and opinions are on the camera that I've got my weapon at the moment as well, guys. It kind of reminds me of um, the Red Tide camo from Call of Duty. It kind of reminds me of that, but it's a pretty cool camo. Reloading. Um... Just wish the frames were not keep dropping. They just keep dropping every so often. I found my kitty cat. Right, this needs to stop lagging. It's lagging on my screen, guys. I'm sorry if it is lagging on the screen that you're seeing, but... There's nothing really I can do about it. It's just frames dropping a little bit, that's all. Uh, I just don't get it. Like, how... How are we going to get through to that particular character? Ooh. I don't know how we're going to get Rescue Takia or Rochelle in this case. Oh, there's a knife. Can I have that knife? Whoa! It's a big guy, big guy, big guy, big guy. Right, I need your help. We need to kill this big guy. That's what I'm trying to. He's <laughs> gonna mash you up, my friend. He's literally just mashing him. I'm just glad he's not gonna come after me though. But it's all right. I've got you. I've got you. Right. Stop napping on the floor. You get your health on. And we just need to go and find a way to get through this room now. Right, so we've got the knife. Ah, he's it's, it's got rid of the cobwebs off the door, which is good. Right. Can you open that door for me, please? Open, please. Open. Boy, this knife seems really lethal. I'm going to keep hold of this. For some, I was just going to say, for some strange reason, it wasn't going to let me open the door. It's like, okay, we can't proceed up ahead because there's like many zombies blocking the doorway, but this knife is B right now. Look at this. Slice, slice, slice. Chop, chop, chop. <clears throat> so just watching all these zombies' heads just like fly clean off. Right. Takio is back in the game now. We still need to find Dempsey. Or Coach in this case. I'll either name them by their Left 4 Dead names, or I'll call them by the characters' names. Really? It makes it easier for you guys. Right, um... Ooh, is that a little nose in here? Adrenaline, shot here. An adrenaline on the floor. Got a medikit. 
First aid. Um. Gonna heal. Another shot. All right, now I'm back. What is this? Adrenaline shot. Right. Want to become a junkie? Give me my needle. Now I've got my Red Bull back. <laughs> Gonna be a junkie and then just eject myself with Red Bull. So then uh, that seat is then I'm just gonna be high doused up on caffeine to my eye, but until the point my eyeballs are popping out my head. Okay, I don't know what Wreck It Ralph is doing right there. I think he was just like just resting his head on the wall. I guess you know, I I don't know. It's a bit weird. Um. Hang on a sec. What kind of shit ending is that? I ain't dead. I'm coming back for more. Okay, so we're gonna get rid of this bulldozer. We've got to go onto the side here. Is that gonna trigger it? Time to stop pissing around and get this big guy back into action. Okay, that's not gonna work. Um <laughs> Sorry, Takio. Sorry, you gotta stay over there. Oh, where's Takio? Okay. How did you get there? It's like you were over there just a second ago. I wish I could teleport. Sandy's just taking a nap, everyone. So just, you know, let us sleep. Can you hear me? I'm trapped in here. We're coming to you now, okay? Just be patient. This is as close to I hear one of those <laughs> <laughs> Squidward's taking a beat and Sandy's having a nap. I'm expecting like a SpongeBob or something pop up in a moment. Just got that gut feeling about it. Alright, come here, Dempsey. I'll let you out. Thanks. You're welcome. Um uh, okay. Let's try what see what this doohickey does. Hello? Huh. Okay. Uh oh, I'll take it, we've got to press it again. Okay, let's level this off. Is that right? Ah, just a little bit more. Is that okay? I think that's okay. A little bit more. Right, I think we're good. We're good. Right, shiny coin there. Got the um, eagle medal. Whoa, that's a lot of freaking zombies. That's one thing you gotta love about games like this, it's always loads and loads and loads of enemies, like, it's freaking loads of them. Right. I'm just glad that me and my team aren't going to get squashed by a giant bulldozer this time. <clears throat> right, so we've got the disc, the MO disc 2. I'm not quite sure what these discs do, but I'm guessing they're going to come as a good purpose later on or something. That's what I'm guessing, but I, I just don't know. Um, come on, team. You've got your cat, you have a sniper rifle, and I have my kitty. And my kitty is lethal. Everyone thinks it's just a cat, but really it's a skin for an Uzi. It's a mini Uzi and it's really deadly. So come on team, cats and sniper rifles is a go. Our mission is to kill anything that walks. Reloading. Over then ourselves. Damn it. Do it for the kitty. Reloading. Reloading. Let's put like that. <coughs> So yeah, I hope you all enjoying part 4 so far guys. If you are, then give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. Really would appreciate it. Um, as the seat is... Um, I'm just going to make a little will right now. As it is, I just think this game's awesome. I love Left 4 Dead. Um, as seat is, I do enjoy playing on the PC. I mainly started at first ever playing Left 4 Dead. Um, back in the day, upon the Xbox 360 is when I first ever first started playing this game for the very first time. And obviously it didn't have any of these cool mods or nothing. It was just the standard game. And I loved it even back then. Like, it was a great game. 
And I do hope in the nearby future we do see Left 4 Dead 3 because it would just be amazing. And I'm hoping there's going to be mod support even if it does go on console and stuff. But let me know down below in the comment section. Do you still play Left 4 Dead 2? If you do, you are awesome. And same for Left 4 Dead 1 as well. If you play that as well, you are awesome. Right, I think we've reached the safe room. Take that, you mealy mouth and there we go, guys. We managed to do that there. So, I'll see you What I'm going to do now, guys, I'm going to bring this video to an end. If you have enjoyed it, then give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. Really would appreciate it. That was part four to my walkthrough on left for Resident Evil 1. I've got plenty more parts on this game and much, much more still to come. So, make sure you keep your eyes and ears locked onto my channel. If you are new, make sure you subscribe. Leave some feedback and comments down below in the comment section. And I'll see you again next time.